So they have this laser X set. That's pretty cool. I had my little brother go and ask them if they had any Nerf stuff because they never say yes to me. So, um, I, yeah, my brother. I almost want to get this and see if I can turn this into like a powerhouse pistol. That'd be kind of cool to do sometime. But not today. Best find of all time. To my knowledge, these are pretty rare. It's... Well guys, I don't know about you, but I think I got a really good haul here. Uh, we got a Bulldog, we got a uh, Air Addictor with a mag, some similar gear, one of these things, and then a Super Drum. It's missing a drum, but I recently thrifted a different drum, so that's pretty cool guys. Came off really good with that haul right there. Hello everyone, Brickasaurus 27 welcome to Nerf Thrifting with Brickasaurus. Episode 17. Alright, so we got a lot of stuff to cover. Good thing. This is a pretty large haul. Probably not my largest, but one of the largest for sure. So let's get started with some of the pistols and then we'll move on to other things. First, got a big shock. You know, not a big deal. This was, I got this for a dollar, but they went down, they went down to 50 cents with it, which is pretty cool, because that day was a half-off day, so that was nice, got a big shock, you can always use these for different things, you can mod them, shoot rival, and do, and whatnot, and plus the big, oh, the big shot's one of my favorite, uh, nerf pistols of all time, as far, and probably one of my favorite mega blasters, just because how cool it is, nice compact little mega launcher, so that's pretty cool, again, not really a big deal, very common, Another thing, you got X Shot. This was two bucks, which is not a bad deal at all. Uh, these are really good blasters, and yeah, definitely can use that for something. Probably rip the spring out of it, or who knows? We'll see. Next, we got a similar gear thing. This was a dollar. You know, not really anything special. I thought this was a barrel attachment, but it does not attach to any of my Nerf barrels. So I don't know what I'll do with that. Probably just throw it in the attachments bin. Next, got a Triad EX, Triad EX3. This is pretty cool. This was, as far to my attention, uh, 50 cents because of the half off day. Even though it says $2 here, I still got 50 cents for it. Which, you know, no complaints. Ne and then next, we have a Glow Shot. Now, the catch spring is, is, is broken, but pretty nice. And for 50 cents, a really good deal. Now, this was not on the half off day, and this was at a totally different thrift store, but catch ring is broken but I can probably fix that it does not catch so let's see if I can I'll see if I can fix that maybe do a repair video on it we'll see this is pretty cool though I have very good condition and the glow shots a neat little blaster so very very nice very nice next we have this thing 
Please tell me in the comments what this is and if it can be used for anything at all. It looks more like a, it looks kind of like a Tech Six, which is interesting. But I guess it, the spring feels pretty powerful. So maybe is it good for springs? Because I've seen people pick these up before. So are these really good or not? Let me know in the comments. This looks really cool, so I thought I'd pick it up just for the shell. Never know what you can do with that. Next, we got a broken Magnus. Now, this was $5. I never paid that. I wouldn't pay $5 for a working Magnus. But it was half off day, and I think I can fix it because the trigger is not. It's already primed, and the trigger is just not activating the blaster. So, yeah. I, could, I think I'll make a master key out of this because I already have enough. This is my second Magnus. We'll see if I can do a Magnus master key. That would be really epic. But yeah, Magnus, it's broken, but can be fixed. I do have, like, uh, I'm, I'm going to be doing it. It's kind of coughing, spring insanity, so sorry. If, sorry about that. But I'm going to be doing some repair videos. Yeah. It's not really coughing, spring insanity, because I've been wanting to do it anyway. So, yeah. Next, we got, I went and went ahead and got that scatter blast, the second scatter blast at the thrift store. This is my second one in good condition. And these are the limited edition scatter blasts. Not really necessarily rare, just kind of more scarce than normal scatter blasts. So pretty cool to get a scatter blast. Great blaster. One of the best super soakers. Next we got a really good blaster, an air addictor. These are really neat blasters, really powerful, they pack a punch. And I got the super soaker for two bucks three bucks. Very nice blaster. Let me kind of get it out of frame here because it's kind of getting a little this blasters are gonna get bigger from here. So very nice to get this again not really the the best blaster but pretty cool and also with the mag that attaches to all those other mags which is great for two dollars that's a steal and it was the stock i also have an extra barrel air addictor is a great blaster and for two bucks i'll grab that any day another thing for two bucks is a mega bulldog very nice a very nice blaster it's not really practical but still cool and gimmicky like the deploy for two dollars not a bad deal. I do not own one of these. So definitely cool to get that. And for $2, again, I'll pick that up all the time, any day, for, because of that. Next, we got oh, two Reapers. The Reapers are, really, Reapers are really good blasters. One of the coolest uh, Air Warriors blasters. Very nice and ergonomic and cool in design. For $3, you can't beat that. And there's another one for 3 uh, these have some potential for modding, I believe. So yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Not too big of a deal, but very nice to have because I like those blasters a lot. Last but certainly not least, we got a super drum. I do I can barely fit this in the camera. Super drums are is a blaster I've been really wanting for a long time. But I just never got around to buying one. And it is a good blaster, but it is missing the drum. I got it for two dollars, which is a steal. I I do have the drum. I have I, I thrifted a drum quite a while back, and I just had an impulse to get that drum in case I find a super drum without a drum. And the drum costs like fifty cents. So now I got a super drum with its drum, and I'm saying drum a lot. Uh, so now I got that. That'll be great. I can just attach that drum onto there, and there we go. Really nice to find one of those. I've been wanting one for a while. And great. That's great. For $2, great deal. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. That will about wrap up the video. Not too much, not too little. A good equilibrium of a lot of stuff. A fairly big haul. Anyway, guys, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. My junk drawer. My junk drawer. So many things I don't know what they're for, but... I won't let it go, no, I will add more useless little things to my junk drawer.